Hello everyone, my name is Chris. In today's video we will take a look at what I consider to be one of the best builds for the heavy class in order to dominate the competition at the moment in a 12-man scenario in World Tour. Unfortunately, I got completely cooked at the start and we have to redo the intro, but we are gonna be completely fine. So if you take a look at the macro situation on the map, we are placing the cash out at A and it feels like it's gonna be split, meaning that we will only have two teams on us because, you know, one team has to defend other cash out this is a very interesting one because not only you will be able to drop it with the c4 that we will replace right now we have three c4s actually and i'm actually gonna save up mine we're gonna throw it under like this you can climb here and then you can climb here and you can probably place it here we're gonna also throw a gas barrel right there and a gas barrel up top, just to make sure that, you know, oh, there is no way you can jump up here. Just to make sure that you are safe from both angles. We have some time to prepare. I don't need to look around. I know that if opponents are approaching, they're going to approach right now. We have like the ultimate, ultimate scenario right now. Like, what the hell is that? Anyways, um, I'm thinking about ways that we can play. And where is my team exactly? Ah, they're playing on a crane, which is okay. I like it. I'm not playing the barricade, which is going to be the usual standard thing for me personally. I'm trying out the C4 to see how it works. And sometimes the finals is just like this. You can look at tab and see that every single team has damage numbers, meaning that they are fighting. But as you can see here, I'm being detected. We are being approached. And I'm actually curious to see what we can do here. I blew someone up. Someone died. I'm trying out some positions to be useful. We're gonna approach and... Wow! I guess it absolutely cooked me beyond imagination. Interesting. It seems like they both shot at me. And then we have a stealthy pro using throwing knives and evasive dash. They're like, yup, I'm taking you out with me. Oh, hell nah. Oh, hell nah. Uh, you can use a breach charge. Just make sure that they, when they steal, you use it. Okay. I'm gonna coin in five seconds. Well, that was... Mm -hmm. I'm gonna coin and hopefully we still have the C4, right? We don't. We don't, we don't, we don't. Okay, maybe interrupt it once. Nice. Oh no, they are stealing again. Maybe I will be able to help. Okay. This guy is dead as well. We are looking around. I'm gonna yoink the guy right here and hopefully... I am so lost for words. Hopefully res him here safely. Res him here. Nice. Well, thank God. Thank God my, my player is playing, you know, this kind of thing. All right. We're going to let them be. We kind of don't care for them. Just going to res our teammates. When you find yourself in a situation where you are mm, down players, most important thing you can do is to go and res them. Because, you know, approaching two versus three might not be the smartest idea on the chessboard okay so so far so far so good i got the first cash out uh, it was pretty painful but all righty taking the zipline our guy is making sure that we are taking it with them bro is like set up set it up okay we're gonna approach big rpg on this guy it's a mgl mm-hmm oh he's got the evasive dash Okay, we're gonna cook up the barricade, or excuse me, the dome shield. I... Help. Help. Okay, we're just gonna play some mesh. Play some mesh until we slow reset. I am so washed beyond imagination, and they're throwing cards in my face, which is certainly does not help, and we don't have a barricade to really, like, hide behind it. This is... Heavy is certainly one of my weakest class when it comes to, you know, ability to flex. And then the Fizero guy is gonna die here. We're just gonna recharge our RPG. Go for this guy. We're gonna yoink our trophy from the maximum range. Go behind the first safe corner and res our teammate. Okay, if you take a look at the situation on the map, it's just a DM free for all. Um, nothing interesting going on. Nothing interesting happening, so... Uh, I mean, we can just have some fun, right? Alright. And, um, I mean, as you can see, shotgun is still uh, very much a superior weapon when it comes to everything else. Because of how easy it is to, how easy it is to use and everything. So, alrighty. 
Let's actually go D. Um, I'm not not sure about not sure about this throw. I I think this is um, uh, you know, pretty terrible. But I feel like we will be able to figure it out. Game looks absolutely beautiful. I love it. I love the design. I love the details, the textures. Everything is just so freaking nice. And I have a person with a shotgun in my face. Help! And he just killed me. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, you can go for me. I'm defeatable. Does he have a defib? He doesn't. Well, yes, 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 yes. Gonna revive cover me is a great thing. Is he playing on a controller? No, he's MNK. Alrighty. We don't have... We don't have a jump pad, but I'm gonna use the zip line. Yes, I'm gonna jump up here. And then... Oh... I, uh, I'm getting absolutely devoured. Have players been, like... You know, progressing slowly, and I've been just washed. Jesus Christ. Or is it just the fact that I'm, um, you know, approaching one versus three? All right. Oh, yes. Let's go. And then that was some sort of a low gravity, or the jump pad got changed a little bit. You know, nice, nice. We are rezzing. I like it. I like it. The overall level of gameplay has been, you know, gradually becoming, like, more and better and better. All right, we cook this guy, and then it feels like we can your fake, and then fight. Hello. Well. Ah. Okay. 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 Sure. 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 All right. We had a little rebound off of that, but we'll actually see. So. I see that there is a person with an MGL, you know, trying to do something. There is this glitch thing that is very, very annoying. I can't use my mesh shield. I have honestly no clue what's going on in this game and I absolutely love it. Alright, we're just gonna go for the C4 and then we can mesh shield. We can play one below, guys. Drop down, drop down one floor if you need. Alright. Just playing behind my mesh shield. MGL guy has nothing to do with us. I don't think he can push. And then I'm just, you know, playing closer. Just trying to steal. I'm gonna go for the... You know? Go for that thing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Nice. This guy got cooked and we just have to survive. And nerd. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> God damn it, man. We just had to survive, but yeah. This is okay, this is okay. We got one minute left. And what we need to do is interrupt one of the cashouts so it doesn't go in. Because this is going to be 28,000 for purple team if they take it. And if they're going to get 28,000, we are going to be second place, which will put us below the qualification line. So what we have to do is, I guess, just have fun because cashout 5 is, or vault 5 is pretty far. And we just go. Uh, it doesn't matter what we do here, we still qualify because we are always going to be second place. All right, so I'm going to approach from here and then try to sneak up some interesting... Hello. I'm gonna... Try to sneak up some interesting kills. Like, damn, man. They are, like, opponents have been, you know... Opponents are cooking us. Wait, excuse me. All right, so... Is this... Uh... Oh, uh... Instead of, instead of trying to go and steal, my guy decided to, you know, like, confront me. I understand. Happens. That's life. That's life. Alrighty, moving on to the next phase. Well, I mean, I mean, I am god-awful at the game. Terrible. Jesus Christ. Like, I... <laughs> and then, yeah, we just, need to, we just need to get back in shape. I have a tournament soon. Yeah, which is going to be a 12-man, heavy, medium, light only. So we're going to participate in that one. And then, yeah, shotgun feels incredibly powerful, especially on Monaco, close quarter environments. And then everything is in buildings. Uh, you have to push the cash out at some point, And it's just, it's just very, very difficult to do anything against that, right? Suspended structures. Thank God we have a person who is using movement, zipline. Outside of that, we would be completely freaking cooked. So, on suspended structures, it's going to be very, very important to close up the distance. And if you don't do that, yeah, um, 
They're just gonna stand above and shoot you. One of the most unbalanced um, cash out to retake ratio map modes you can possibly think of because you have to spend two RPGs to drop down the structure and then it becomes really, really ugly at the end of the day. I don't even know how people, you know, thought of a good idea like that. I, I, I don't know. Overall, this is my third game um, in World Tour in Season 3, and I absolutely love it. Um, it's a pretty nice thing if you are a new player. I feel like I've had just too much exposure to that kind of game, right? And then, ooh, look at the meta. I absolutely love it, man. I absolutely love it. Look, we have a guitar guy, we have a flamethrower guy, and then we have a spare guy, and then I'm playing shotgun. Hell nah. Like... Talk about diversity. Talk about mm, talk about making uh, the difference when it comes to build choices. This is actually really cool. I like it. I really enjoy it. <laughs> this is nice. This this is what you would like to see um, in a casual game, right? It's playing hook. They're playing dash, and then like, wow, this is great. This is great. I I love it. I love it. This is how the game should be. Mm. It is a big shame that this wasn't the game season 1, otherwise, like, it would be a massive, massive success on the FPS market. Uh oh, unfortunately one guy got cooked, and then we're taking the zipline, and going in. I have to account for the fact that my teammates are not gonna approach at the same time as me, so, you know, I have to be a little bit more careful with how I press W on people, because... I am usually playing with like top tier players and we are just pressing W and everything and destroying you know as a like one man army and stuff but here I just have to be a little bit more conservative when it comes to when it comes to my approaches. So here we're gonna yoink our guy. He got you know yoinked by himself. Just gonna take him from full range and res him before behind the first um, resable corner, and then okay, let's go. Breach here, hold this position. Yo, this is cool. This is cool. Mm -hmm. So there is a person right there. We can see that, and my guy decided to die. Well, sure, I'm gonna go for him. Maybe this guy decided to die as well. We will see. Yes, yes, yes. It happens. It happens when you pull the blanket in multiple directions. Um, someone is definitely going to be cold at the end of the day. Alright, so we're gonna yoink. We're not gonna yoink. Huh? Maybe we yoink right now? Okay. Okay. It seems like I am being pushed. I'm gonna shoot it twice to a small reload. And then and this is like the prey turned into a hunter, you know? Kind of thing. And I don't even know what we are doing. We just need to go B, actually. This is just a complete waste of time. We certainly don't want to do that. All right, going in, going in. I don't think you have to spend the zip line right here to rotate. I feel like you need to use it in order to get to the cash out because how on earth are we going to do it brother how on earth we'll never know i guess we can like spend an rpg all right um it seems very very bad for us right now because you know i am being slowly cooked and there is nothing i can do about it we are suffering and struggling. Can you please zipline us to to the thing next time? That would be great. That would be great. I got cooked by the nade for 112 as well, which is like strange to say the least. All right, at least we have a jump pad. I'm pretty sure if we're gonna get spawned, we'll be able to have the chance at A. But we need to we need to have a proper zip on it. So proper zip is when it's indestructible you place it right here on the wall and you know it's gonna be pretty difficult to do anything about it i am not sure if we'll be able to do anything at b so you need to you need to zip right away right now yes 
And then we have to... Yeah, you, you just steal it. You just steal it. I'm gonna shield you. I don't think this is possible. This uh, this seems very unrealistic, to say the least. Steal it, bro. Steal it. Hello. <laughs> and that's a guitar. And that's a guitar. Oh my god. No, this is, this is way more way more difficult than I thought it would be. Well, the guy wasn't stealing uh, for the first, like, two seconds. Maybe his stuff got bugged or something, but... Yeah, that's just that's just life. We could just threw the trophy away and started rezzing in the middle of nowhere. I like that. I like that. Still have two coins and it's a medium and a light. So it's a two versus two scenario. I think we'll be able to, you know, cook this up. Boom. He's got an evasive dash again. Throwing me. <laughs> Throwing me again and rezzing. Nice. Really good. All right. All right. Nothing bad happened still. We are just, you know, surviving. We're just surviving. We might be able to... No, cook them up. This guy is absolute 1 HP if you can. And this guy has a guitar. Right, guitar is not the best weapon against a shotgun. And... Yeah, it's certainly not the greatest. Alright, we're just gonna go. Continue our 1 versus 3 kind of scenario. I am being detected, leashed, you know. And we're just gonna res. Are they gonna allow us? Yes. Seems like they will. Okay. Let's go for the cash out C if we can. But there is this guy with a guitar as well. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. Please. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. Please. Oh my god. All right. Defib. We don't have it. But we have a shotgun and we are approaching. Jesus Christ. What is the game turned into? <laughs> An absolute disaster. Well, this is like the closest you get from um, Call of Duty Deathmatch Free for All. Oh. Oh. This guy's getting cooked by the turret. Yes. 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 Nice, he's absolute 1 HP. I am very safe to res, especially given the fact that he's a sword player. Absolute, talk about absolute counters. We need to go, guys. We need to go... Let's go see. Talk about absolute freaking counters. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Are we going? Well, it seems like we are absolutely not going, which is going to be a positional mistake, macro mistake, because the cash out is half, and then if we place it, that's going to be really difficult to do anything about it, right? So, we're just going to go. Alright, sure, let's place it and let's try to defend it against, like, three teams, which is going to be borderline impossible if you ask me, but we will try our hardest. I'm going to bring the gas. Hopefully this guy is not going to destroy the zipline before we're going to come up. And then I am very much already almost dead, which is not ideal. Alright, I'm just gonna wait for, for my HP to go up again. Then he's jumping. Oh, please. I'm gonna res my guy using a bubble. Luckily, enemies cannot go like that. Right. Well, they can actually. And then the guitar guy really wants to approach. We're gonna allow him. And then maybe, maybe. Alright, guitar guy is down. I, I <laughs> Nice! Let's go, man. Well played. Right? Alright, and my guy coined. I'm gonna res. This is this is very hectic. I don't understand what's going on. And I like it. Alright, alright, alright. Give me some time. Oh please help. Oh please help. Alright, we're gonna use a bubble. I'm gonna stay alive for a little bit of time. And then we're just gonna cook this guy. Resum, resum. We need a zipline. We urgently need a zipline. Okay, there's a shortcut. We're reloading and approaching. I'm gonna approach like that. And then maybe climb up here. Nope. Maybe climb up here. Nope. Uh oh, this guy is. This guy is scary. Uh oh. Nope, I'm fine. Do I have another zipline? I don't. Maybe Stealthy Pro is gonna help me? Nope, he's not gonna help me. Maybe I can... So Ooh! No, 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 no. This is the... <laughs> Alright. I just got absolutely cooked by the guy. And we stole it, actually. And we are rezzing. Wait a second. He rezzed. Okay, okay. Dashing, dashing. Again. Nice. <gasps> bridge charge. He forgot to do it. Oh my god, that would be so great. He's got it! Okay, bridge charge, bridge charge, bridge charge, man. Blow it up, blow it up. Nice! Oh my god! He cooked one with the nate and another one with the mite. Wait a second. Cooking? 
Huh? No, I never, I should never underestimate my teammates. Damn, bro. This was great. This was great. All right. Let's go for more. Let's go for more. Just gonna shield the guy while he's reviving. And then maybe we'll, you know, look at our chances at the cash out B. Boom, 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 boom. Legends say that you run faster with dome shield, but actually you just have better, better line of sight with it. So that's that's why I'm using it, right? I'm just gonna go. This is gonna be another suspended structure. If you look at top, this is three two two situation, three two one right now, and we are gonna approach. This is in house. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna open the door like this. We're gonna jump up here. We're gonna jump up here. We're gonna jump up here, and now we are in. I okay, bro. All right, this is this is crazy. Okay, double medium shotgun in my face. Nice, nice. My guy is cooking. Okay, ah, ah, nice. Okay, okay. Wait, no words. Zero comments. Zero comments about this one. This is very losable. This is very losable. If what if what if pink team steals? No. Okay, now. We are cooking. We are going into the finals with this one. I cannot believe my teammates actually carried me. My teammates actually low-key carried me. And we are playing against... Luckily, we are not playing against double shotgun, which is... Oh, thank God. Because that would be that would be a complete disaster. Okay, world tour continues. I am... Um, I am just... You know, lost for words. This is very interesting. This is very fun. I feel like I feel like heavy roll is not particularly the greatest when it comes to world tour because you are consistently getting uh, aped, you are consistently getting cooked from left and right, you are consistently being pursued by uh, other players. You have the biggest model on the market to shoot, and then it's just it's just a complete disaster. I would rather play something like a light sniper. That would be that would be really cool. That would be really nice to play actually. If the map is gonna allow, we're gonna cook up an episode just like this. Maybe I'm gonna look for some like sneaky sniper. That would be that would be freaking great, and outside of that, yeah, everything is nice. I like it. Okay, so they're playing double AK, double AK, and a sledgehammer versus double shotgun and throwing knives. If I were to um, on Monaco duck and cover, huh? We're interesting. Okay, so I kind of counter the guy with a sledgehammer of some sort, and then it's just gonna be, you know, it's just gonna be pretty difficult. What if we try Louis gun? What if we try Louis gun right now? I'm actually very curious to see how it will, um, you know, work, if it's gonna work as well, because it's like a duck and cover, you don't have church, everything is open pretty much, so we'll see, we'll actually see. I'm curious, I'm curious. Actually, I'm not curious, I, I just absolutely hate playing shotgun. Okay, he's playing, he is playing mm, grappling hook, or not the grappling hook, what is it called? Just a just a roadhog hook, which is nice for us, which is really good. We kind of counter him. I'm actually very curious to see how Lewis Gun is gonna perform. Probably it will be a little bit better than I thought it would be. I heard that they completely cooked the recoil on the weapon, which is pretty difficult to use right now. So we're gonna climb up here and we're gonna take the vault first. It doesn't matter in the final round, but still pretty good. Okay, we're gonna place a C4 right here. And then patiently wait for opponents to... Uh-oh. Approach. Boom. Alright. Oh. 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 Wait, what? Oh. Nice. One more. Nice. One more. Wow. Very good. Very good. Very good. And then we have a turret. Yes, he's gonna rise up. Oh, he missed. No. And me, me, me. Yes, yes, yes. No, no, no. No, wait, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Yes, let's go. Let's go. Okay, we need we need 83 with a C4, which is like not justifiable. You should not do that. And in terms of the Lewis gun, do I like the weapon? Oh my god, the recoil is cray cray, but it's okay. I think we will be exceptionally and completely and absolutely fine. Alright, so this is the cash out we're gonna go for. Alright, alright, no problem. We're gonna place a C4 below. And if they would want to, you know, if, if they would want to do something, this is gonna be big disaster for them. I'm gonna flip the cash out right now, and the C4 is gonna end up below, so they won't be able to manually break it. 
also... Oh, no. It's just, uh, you know. All right. Now, coming up the coming up the ladder right here. We're gonna try to meet them early, meet them close. Hopefully, they're not gonna pad on us, because that's gonna be a complete disaster. Okay, I see them here, and... It is... Oh my god, it's borderline impossible to do anything with this weapon. It is actually... Like, this is low-key so Oh my god, what am I supposed to do against that? How am I supposed to do anything against that? We just hooked me and three-tapped me. Wait a second, we are so dead. Why would I even go for the Lewis gun? This is... Oh! Guy's just cooking us. I, I'm lost for words. There is nothing I could do. Okay, okay. okay. Let's go. Nice, nice, nice. And then I'm gonna respawn with a coin. I'm coming, I'm coming, bro. Just give me some time. We're gonna cook. Maybe an RPG like that. Boom. I mean, it's not enough. We have a zipline, though. We have a zipline and a dream. Look at this, look at this. I'm gonna go for, like, here. And I'm gonna throw a C4. And then I'm gonna climb up here. Oh, nice. Uh oh no, 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 no. Please, please, please. I have family, kids, a wife, parents to feed. Please don't do that. All right, and then we are patiently waiting. Okay, I have a C4 and a dream. Look at this, look at this. Okay, we're gonna throw... We're gonna blow it up. Wait a second, wait a second. With patience, 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 patience. Hello? Patience, pa hello? Huh? So they're like... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, this is not what I wanted to do. Please, 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 please. All right, we're gonna jump up here. There is no way to jump. <laughs> I'm so dead. All right, it's time to fight this guy. And then this guy... No, 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 no. Everyone is gonna think that I'm a bad player. Well, in reality, I'm a bad player. Lewis gun, awful. Absolutely terrible. You should not play this weapon at all. It went from being S tier ability... Like, you had the ability to cook people across the map to absolutely god useless. It is crazy how bad this weapon is. But we cooked the first cache. Oh, Yo, this is crazy. It's crazy what they did. They set traps. They laid them. I mean, strategies have been evolving, right? Uh oh. There is just nothing you can do. All right. I think there is... Um, I'm pretty sure there is still skill-based matchmaking in World Tour because people clearly understand what they are doing. Um, especially when it comes to pressing buttons. Maybe they are not the best at, like, defending and stealing cash-outs, macro and stuff, but... Apparently, they know how to press their buttons, which is cool, which is really interesting. I haven't been able to use my mesh shield because it's being completely countered by, you know, the thing. Oh, and then someone behind, I'm dropping down. Yeah, this is what I mean by saying that, you know. Maybe it's not the prettiest role to play. Alright, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what happens here. They still haven't placed the cash out. We are just fighting for... You know, absolutely nothing. I need to group up with my team and help them a little bit. Man, like what? <laughs> Every single time. Okay, res before behind the first safe corner. I was picking my nose. But now it's, it's, it's time to res again. Okay, sure. Only medium alive, which is good. My light somehow was able to cook up the... Maybe... And then mm, we are going towards the cash out scene. Nice zip line. I like it. We're going to jump up here, jump again, and jump again. All right. It feels like this guy is going to place it in, which is going to be a big, big, big mistake. He is struggling to do that. That's. <laughs> yes. That was so good. He's like, how am I supposed to do that? Uh oh, taking stairs here is like very risky. <clears throat> All right. Well, I'm gonna join this guy, resin behind first safe corner. My guy is cooking. Alright, we are cooking as well. He's gonna stay alive for a little bit longer. I'm gonna be able to help him. I don't see anyone, but I see this annoying thing. Aha, I see him now. Well, good sir, you are completely dead. There is nothing you can do. Maybe you can stall him a little bit, you know? Where is he? 
This is actually good. If we can kill him after they respawn, this is just gonna be a complete disaster. We don't need to we don't need to do anything fancy. Just place another C4. And then play above if possible, right? Maybe confront this person. Okay. Nice, nice shield usage. And I need some utter and like I need some help. Alright, I, I did something with the C4 to interrupt the steel, right? And then hopefully, hopefully... Oh, is this guy gonna cook? I oh, please! No! Oh no, yes! Okay, okay. No! And it seems like we are lost on this one. Alright, alright. This is gonna be a little bit more interesting than I thought it would be. Ah, oh, god damn it. Lewis gun was definitely a mistake, guys. It was definitely a big, big, big mistake. I should not have done that. This is just um, this is just a disaster and a half. It seems like the recoil is certainly making it way worse than I thought it would be. All right, all right, all right. Moving on to the last final cash out. Hopefully this time we are gonna be a little bit more lucky with. You know, no, this is this is just like wow. I don't know why, but they completely cooked the lose gun to the point where it's. Pretty pointless to use, probably for terminal attack. People were afraid that mm, it's gonna ruin the whole, you know, low, and then they would like buff the LH1 to the point where it's impossible to lose. So yeah, that's fun. That's fun. All right, we're gonna find a spot here to jump up. Gonna take it. Okay, now I'm finally feeling warmed up because this was my first game of the day. Um, feeling really, really rusty. Feeling old. This is how boomers feel, right? Every single day of the week okay so we have the chance to play a or we have the chance to play d and i like d a lot more actually i like d a lot more <laughs> uh, that sounds really sorry excuse me i'm not gonna i'm not gonna say much all right so we are moving towards the cash out d it's a double heavy medium or excuse me double medium heavy composition and they have this annoying spare guy that just makes me question my life choices he always have the corner to hide behind and then he has some sort of heels behind him and then they are approaching right here and right there yeah, there is like nothing i can do unfortunately i am just hopeless here and then if we give them enough high ground uh they're just gonna cook us oh but i uh, but i shielded but i shielded no i didn't okay sure I feel like shield is not gonna help you that much with it, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. This is still the first, just the first approach. Surely we will be able to cook them right now. Alrighty. My guys are trying their absolute hardest, I can tell. I can tell. Oh, mine is gonna get cooked on a mine. Boom, vanish bomb, 5 HP. Okay, running away. 3 seconds for my coin, and then he's gonna res. Nice, I'm coining. And then I'm going in. You should not have died, Mr. Sir, on light, but that's okay. That's okay. We're just gonna wait for him. 24 more seconds. And then he died in, like, the worst spot possible, like, on their head, which is uh, pretty, gonna be pretty difficult for us to do anything against them. All right? I am, like, losing it right now in terms of my ability to, you know, carry games. Okay, we'll kill this guy. He's gonna get rest. We're gonna kill this guy. I'm reloading. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bait. And then I'm gonna fight. Okay, we're gonna open the door from outside just like this. Then we're gonna jump up if we can. Alright. Gonna get rid of this bubble. Fake. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, we stole it a second. Hey, no way, bro. Hey, no way, we did it. We actually did it. Oh my god. What a game to be alive. <laughs> we got it, bro. We got it. Let's get it. All right. So this is gonna be it. Um, What do I think about shotgun? Exceptional weapon. What do I think about this one? N not so much. No, I, I would definitely not go for the... Uh, I would definitely not go for the Lewis gun, but yeah. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next one. Take care.